What's going on guys and welcome to another video. Today I thought I'd show you guys the three most requested outfits to obtain if they are ever brought back to the game for company coin or battlefield coins. Now these outfits may not interest some people but over time I've seen many people wanting these to come back to the game so they can obtain them. But let's get into it. Starting off with the pit crew outfit. Now this has been very popular over time. I remember when I first obtained this it was available two weeks after DICE released outfits for battlefield coins and that was a long time ago. This was released for company coin by mistake and I managed to pick it up, but shortly after it was removed and I have only seen it return to the armory maybe twice. At the time, this outfit was very unique simply because the entire outfit was something we haven't seen before and it wasn't a recycled version of other outfits. I'm sure when it comes back to the armory, people are definitely going to want to pick this up because you just never know when it will return. Moving on to the US outfit, but at the time it was available for the UK faction due to the US not being in the game yet, the Wild Eagle outfit. Now this was only obtained if you managed to purchase the chapter 4 premium booster pack. I guess this was our first hint at the US coming to the game simply because it was just a US outfit, clearly with American flag on the coat itself. Now I'm not sure why DICE hasn't added this to the armory yet for purchase because it's such a good looking outfit and it would obviously be a hit with US in the game now and it seems to be very popular with people wanting to obtain this. But I guess I'll never understand why DICE holds back on certain outfits and gives people such a small window to obtain them. The last popular outfit I think people want to come back is the Yankee outfit. This was a part of a chapter unlock, I believe all the way back in chapter 4, and if you're one of the people that didn't get to obtain this, you will understand why DICE isn't very forgiving if you miss out on chapter rewards because you will never see them return unless it's a part of a bundle or a year 1 or 2 edition of the game. Now this outfit is a little less detailed than the Wild Eagle, but again a very popular one due to it being a US outfit and not being a copy and paste of other outfits with a different color variant to it. In my opinion, I think DICE needs to bring back these for people that didn't get the chance to obtain them because I believe after all the comments and people wanting these back, they're obviously historically accurate outfits and DICE releasing goofy outfits like the Valentine bundle or the Christmas bundle isn't stuff people want. This is a World War II game after all. But that's just my opinion guys. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Leaving a thumbs up really helps me out and if you're new to the channel, maybe check some videos out and if you like them, maybe consider subscribing and I'll catch you guys in the next one.